Salutation my comment, how you guys doing? Right now I'm heading back to my flat. And I always told you guys that I was gonna do a flat tour for you guys. But I never really got around to it. So I thought on the day that I move out, I'll do a flat tour, which is, you know, not the best thing that you should be doing, but uh, I thought I'd give it a go. I feel a bit uncomfortable filming because I'm right near, my flat is right near primary school. Now this flat, it's uh, called Brahman Court and I, I kind of like the place that I'm living in this year. You know, I mean, it does have some problems. I mean, like someone did get murdered here a while ago. <laughs> you probably think I'm joking, but um, I'm not. I'm heading towards my flat and I'll give you guys a little tour of the actual building and everything. Sorry about the lighting, by the way. The sun keeps changing. So I've had to put my um, camera on auto with the ISO. Now, um, initially I had this plan that I was going to do like this kind of mockumentary kind of thing where I give you guys a tour of my flat and then I sort of was supposed to like fly to my flat and stuff. You know, my friends were supposed to help me with that, but I think most of them moved out earlier than I had moved out. So it was a bit of a struggle trying to do that. So I just thought I'll vlog it and I'll show you guys. Now this right here in Brown Court, this is the game room and I remember when I first came here last year, me and like uh, Joe and some of our friends, we wanted to watch Doctor Who on the TV. We really couldn't because there was like a, like a group of boys just playing like a FIFA tournament or whatever. Well, I think a few sessions on Saturdays, uh, we'd watch Doctor Who, you know, with Peter Capaldi and everything like that. And then back there, we have the kitchen if you want to make a cup of tea and stuff. And this is like the gaming room where um, normally, we, I think there was like a massive pool table here, but um, right now there isn't. Yeah, this room's quite... Nice. Over here we have the snack machine, but no one really uses it since it's like expensive. So right now, whoop, I'm gonna go through the corridor and I'm gonna head to the lift to get to my flat because my flat is on the ninth floor. Last year I was on the fourth floor, uh, but this time I'm gonna be on the ninth floor and it's quite, um, it's a bit of a walk. So uh, I'm just gonna get a lift. So I'm gonna just give you a tour of the laundry room. Ooh, it's quite, it's a bit of a reverb here. Um, it smells lovely here. I don't really come here very often at all. I've only been here like twice, I think, and that was like last year. But I don't really come here because, you know, you need the right amount of change if you're gonna put in the coin. The actual washing machines, they seem quite outdated and you just have to put like soap powder and everything inside the actual machine itself. And then they've got the drying guide as well. Let's go upstairs. Let's go to the lift. No, oh, I've been Rejected. Right, let's step into oh shit. Sorry about that. Right, let's get to number nine. <laughs> so this is this mirror is very dirty, isn't it? Right, so I'm um, just walking straight on and uh, my flat number is floor nine and then the room C so I'm just gonna head now these doors let me get in let's get me key press in okay Ooh. right let's get inside okay so this right here right now is my kitchen and this is where, you know, I cook and stuff. The lighting in here is terrible. That's the reason why I don't tend to shoot a lot of my videos here. I was gonna do a, a cooking session called Cooking with King Khan Abs, but unfortunately my um, my kitchen is not very convenient for that. The actual window is in front of me, so the light's coming this way. However, if I was to cook and show you guys, I would need like some kind of unit to lean on. And so the lighting here is rubbish and the actual light is not the best since it's like very weak, it's not even very powerful at all. And you know, you're probably thinking, oh, why don't you change the bulb? But you know, you can do with that cone that it's on top of the bulb, it's very quite permanent, so you can't really uh, remove it. And so yeah, down there is all my mushla, like my spices and stuff when I cook. It's funny though, it's like when my white mates come and they visit my flat, they're like, what's that? And I'm like, that's spices. Like so many, I'm like, yeah, it's for Asian food. If we go back all the way here, um, it's a bit dark. So I'm just gonna hold it like this. Right over there, you can see this is my bathroom. It's tiny, but you know what? It works, it's fine. I've got my budna over there. My flatmate is a, a Muslim Asian, so it's not embarrassing. Whereas last year I had to hide it. I had to hide my budna, and that's, so that was quite embarrassing to do that. And then over there, you can see my shower with uh, my little facial wash. It's not like I'm sponsored by them, but 
I really hope that they respond to me because that shit works for my skin. So now this is my bedroom. Welcome to my bedroom. This is my bedroom where I make my YouTube videos and you know, I live in it and stuff like that. That's my wall of stuff over there as you can see right there. And it's just decorated with my drawings and pictures and stuff. I prefer this bedroom um, than my last, you know, last year's bedroom. Last year's bedroom, it was tiny. I don't mind a tiny bedroom because my bedroom back home in Burnley is quite small itself. But this one, I've got like a massive, I've got two windows and it's beautiful because I can like, I can see the scenery. I can see the buildings. I'm near some trees. I love trees, I love like nature and stuff and I'm near primary school. My friends for example, they don't like children so they don't like hearing children laugh and stuff whereas me, I don't mind. Uh, I kind of kind of enjoy uh, hearing kids playing around and like, you know, um, like joggers going around uh, jogging and then there's in the distance over there that little city and the cars are going. Yeah, back there you can see um, there's my costume stuff. I, I haven't really used my costume as much this year in my flat but uh, I like to keep my stuff all together. Down here you can see I've got, <laughs> I've got some toy which is quite creepy i've only just got it for like you know leisure purposes i've got it for a reason i was gonna make some kind of like a short horror monster kind of animation kind of thing time so escape from me so i have time to do that but yeah please excuse the mess because obviously i'm moving out today so uh there's that <laughs> This is my flat right now. It's all empty, and so yeah, Ugh. I'm gonna miss this flat. No. Oh well. Goodbye, flat. So right now we're leaving. Uh, there's my brother's car down, down there, and yeah, he's opened the door. Let's let's leave. The guy's opened the door. He was eating. So it's my to the building. Not like that. Either. Oh. She has it left already. Can you? You have to probably turn that. No, I think it's going to open it again. There you go. <laughs> That's a bit of a. On the, on the video, I was going to do the thing where it's like, oh, we're going to go. We don't have to stop. So that was my journey of moving out as well as my plateau. Please be sure to let me know if you guys like these types of vlogs and these types of videos. It was quite emotional moving out but you know, I got through it. I guess that's it for now. Please be sure to comment, like and subscribe. And remember guys, geeks are cool. So love, peace and peace gender. Okay, bye. Subscribe. Sexy.